New right now at 5.30, a year into the pandemic, a local hospital is offering hope by celebrating a recovery. Channel 3 New Haven Bureau Chief Matt McFarland joins us live with a very special reunion, and this is just great, Matt. Yeah, you know, Aaron and Mark, it was one year ago today, Hartford HealthCare's uh, St. Vincent's Medical Center in Bridgeport had its first case of COVID-19. And nurses say for a while it did not look good. They didn't know if this patient was going to even make it. But today, on the anniversary, he was back at the hospital thanking those that saved his life. Walking back into St. Vincent's Medical Center, Rodney Davis got a hero's welcome. But the 22-year-old from Bridgeport was here to thank the heroes that saved his life. I feel like I'm a miracle, and all you guys are my angels. So thank you so much. It's been quite a year for Davis. Exactly one year ago today, he walked into this very same hospital as its first COVID-19 patient. I thought I would just come here, they would check my... You know, my temperature, and then we go back home. But Davis got extremely sick on a ventilator for three weeks. He says he was in a coma for two months. Joanne Tenenbaum was working the ICU when Davis came in as her first patient. I was numb. I was scared for you. And the only thing I did was whisper in your ear, you will make it. And to hang in there, and I'll do everything possible. Yeah, so it's, it's wonderful. <laughs> This is what it was like the last time Rodney was here. An emotional send-off, not just for him, but those who cared for him for months. You got out of the wheelchair, and you were able to walk on your own and into your mother's arms. And I think for all of us, that will be ingrained in our minds and in our hearts forever. The staff here says during what's been a draining year, watching Rodney get better gave them hope, showing them the possibilities during this pandemic. And they inspired him as well. Today, Rodney announced he got accepted into Sacred Heart University with his sights set on becoming a nurse, just like the ones that got him better. I know a few years, that's my, my dream and my goal, to be part of a nursing team. So probably in the future, <laughs> I will be working here.